Hey, welcome back everyone for some more Spyro 2 Ripto's Rage. And we are going to be doing some cleanup here at Summer Forest. By the end of this video, we should have all levels 100%ed here in this first world. But before we continue on, hope you guys have an awesome day today. Hope you guys are, are doing well. But without further ado, let's go back to the very first world, we, first level that we played in, and that is Glimmer. Okay, what do we need yet? We need one more orb and 47 more gems. Hi, Spyro! Okay, we already know what the story is here. Just make sure we're not missing anything at the very beginning. By the way, I'm playing with a new control. My other one, I just could not get my R1 button unstuck, so I'm just, I just went ahead and got my spare one to use right now. But yeah, I really don't want to mess about any uh, here any more than what I have to, so... I'm just gonna go ahead... Let's go ahead and go up here. Up the ladder. And he just tells us to head on up that ladder, that's pretty cool. We'll just do this. There we go. Okay, now we can head up the ladder. But you can see we've gotten... already activated the Superfly. Power. Hey! Great! You've got the Superfly power-up active. Now you can light the gem lamps in this cave. Flame the gem lamps, which is two, st two star out of five difficulty. Much easier with the super flame. Thanks for helping me light the lamp, Spyro. For a while, I was afraid we were going to have to cancel tonight's baseball game. Here, somebody mix this orb in with the baseballs. Twenty orb hype. But I do want to use the super fly ability again because you probably noticed there was a bunch of gems up there that we didn't get. But anyway, we have completed Glimmer, we found all 400 gems and 3 orbs, so we are good to go. Spyro, thanks for helping us fight off the lizards. Please take this talisman of Glimmer as a sign of our gratitude. And the game reminds us that we already have this talisman. This magic portal next to me will take you to Summer Forest, one of the home worlds of Avalar. Cool. But anyway, one down, two to go.
Yeah, I don't, I don't think we played that. I think it just went to the next cutscene. I don't think we actually got to see the end of that, if I remember correctly. But anyway, we are done with Glimmer. Now we just gotta get through Otto Springs and Summer Beach. Though Otto Springs is next along the way, so we're gonna go ahead and go there. Check your guidebook by pressing the. Yes, I know, Allura. I've been checking my guidebook regularly. Now, for Idle Springs, we didn't need the climbing ability in order to finish this. We needed the underwater swimming ability, which here's a portal to Autumn Plains. But anyway, let's head to Idle Springs. Okay, what we gotta do here is at the very beginning. Oh, before we get in, we need 80 more gems and one more orb. I get all the gems here first before I continue on. Which I think the remaining gems are along this stretch, so... Okay, we got all 400 gems. I've been locked in here with all our tools, and the giant idle heads won't let the workers in unless we can solve the three puzzles they've given us. Oh, that sucks. The first puzzle is to turn all these blocks yellow. If you have trouble, come back and talk to me. Solve three giant idle puzzles. The first puzzle is turn all blocks yellow. Ask Foreman Bud for help. Okay, this one is relatively simple. All we need to do is do lower left first, upper left, followed by upper right, followed by lower right. Wow, Spyro, you did it! I mean, I knew you could do it. Now, meet me at the pond for the next challenge. Okay. The pond, we need to go through here. Oh, there he is. This idol says he's hungry and won't be satisfied until he swallowed ten fish. He's got a sensitive stomach, so watch what kind of fish you feed him. Flame fish to feed the idol? This idol is very picky. Okay, blue ones are good. Yellow ones are good. Red ones are not. There we go. 
Okay. Three more. Hello. Okay, we go. Man, that was a ton of red fish. Okay, Spyro, just one more puzzle to go. I'll meet you over by the colored stones for your final challenge. Okay, colored stones. Which are all the way at the, towards the end of the level. What's with your freaking aim? kind of sucks we pretty much have to play the whole level again just to get to the point where we need to. Okay, the colored stones are right here. on these stones in the correct order, you will solve the puzzle. I only know what the first one is. It's up to you to figure the rest out. Jump on the stones in the correct order. Okay. He got... and got blue star. From here on out, we have to jump on green star. We need to go to the orange diamond. We need to go to the orange moon. We need to go to the white moon. And we need to go blue circle. Nice job, Spyro. You're pretty smart for a dragon. All I have to give you is this shiny thing I found in our toolbox. Cool. Now we are done with Idol Springs. All we have left to do is Sunny Beach. No, I could just go and push exit level, but I think I am going to go and just do it the conventional way. But yeah, we're already done with the first, and we're just 15 minutes in, so... And then Sunny Beach shouldn't last too terribly long. Assuming I can find all the gems. But we are done with Idle Springs, we are gonna go ahead, he's gonna... Oh, he's not gonna tell me about the time. okay. Okay. I thought I was gonna have to skip through cutscenes and that, but we don't. Hey, that's nice.
but last but not least, we are going to be headed to Sunny Beach. As you can see, we need two gems here. We're almost back to where we were in terms of gems before we had to pay money bags 500 in order to learn climbing. But on here, we need to find another 103 gems. On. There's no way I can be there, gone. I'm trying to hurry up here and I can't because Fyro can't aim unless I actually have to aim for him. We don't got time come on Turtle, we don't got time for this. But anyway, we climb up here. There we go. And that's really all we needed from that. Which is kind of dumb, but whatever. Spyro, you're literally, like, right there. Now we can get to this part. Hello, young one. There's a chef up at the top of this ladder who wants to make soup out of our turtles. Maybe you could climb up there and stop him. Maybe. Your turtle friends happen to make a very good soup, if I can catch them. You can try to say them if you like, but I'm feeling awfully hungry. See, I think, especially in this part right here, I thought the voice acting here is much better than Reignited. I know there's people that may disagree with me on that, but... And I like this one more than Reignited because I like the camera angle here. So, you saved a few turtles. There are more where those come. Here, take this orb and go away. 
Okay, we get one award for our efforts, but you can probably guess, but especially where they, he said there's more turtles where that came from, well, we're gonna have to rescue more. If you step a little closer to the pot, I'll start ringing my bell again. And this one's five star out of five. But this one shouldn't be too terrible. Really? There we go. Nice. Rats! You save every turtle on the beach. Here, take this. I was gonna use it to buy potatoes, but now I don't need it. Cool. So we rescued every single turtle. We're up to 23 orbs. But we need to go in here. I think we're missing quite a few gems yet. Okay, we need... Oh, I, I know. I know where the missing ones are. I have to go all the way to the beginning. But I know where the missing ones are. Yeah, I keep forgetting about this part of the level. If I'm not mistaken, I forgot about this part even on the Ignited Trilogy. I don't know what it is about this part of the level, but it just escapes my mind all the time. Sunny Beach is complete. But we're gonna go ahead and do it the conventional way. And with that, that means we should have 100%ed Summer Forest. Which we did. Cool. Well, we didn't technically 100% summer for us because we have to go through Ocean Speedway, but I'm talking about like every other level we've 100%ed so far. Thank you, Jan. There we go. Okay, we have already seen that. But yeah, outside of Ocean Speedway, we have done everything there is to do here in summer four so we can dedicate our time to autumn plains now we'll 
we'll just go through here. Go through here, we can get, take the portal to Autumn Plains. Oh, we're back here, okay. Oh yeah, that's right, because if you, if you take the portal near the boss, uh, portal in Summer Forest and it will take you close to the boss portal here in Autumn Plains. That makes sense. Let's go ahead and fly away. Yeah. Let me go ahead and get some sheep. I said let me go and get some sheep. Let's continue on with my tradition of getting an extra life at the end of each video. But the next time I see you guys, we are going to be start here with the first portal here that you encounter in Autumn Plains. And one of my favorite levels in the game, which is Crystal Glacier. Hope you guys are looking forward to that. But thank you guys so much for watching this. Hope you guys are enjoying the series so far. I'll be seeing you guys again next time.